Okay, well, sometimes in the exam questions, we're just asked to make a simple calculation using data. So here's a currency calculation question for you to have a go at. Suppose the exchange rate, the currency value between the US dollar and the pound sterling, is $1 buys 58 pence. What is the price for UK consumers buying textbooks that are priced in US dollars? So this is a simple exchange rate calculation question. Press the pause button, have a go. I'll be back in a few seconds with the right answer. So the current exchange rate is one pound buys 58 pence. There's been no change in the exchange rate, we just asked to make a simple calculation. So a $75 um, exchange rate, that is $75 textbook in the United States, what's it gonna cost in terms of sterling? And the correct answer is A, 43 pounds, 50 pence. At a price of $75 and an exchange rate of $1 buys 58p. Well, of course, that means that one pound buys more than a dollar. So that means expect the price to be lower than 75 in sterling terms. Each textbook will cost $75 times by 0.58 because you're having to give up 58 pence to get a dollar in exchange. And 75 times by 0.58 is £43.50. Hence, the correct option in this question is A. Sometimes the question will ask you to talk about the effect of a fall in the exchange rate. So, for example, if one pound buys fewer dollars, then the UK price of that American textbook would go up. But if the pound strengthened against the dollar, if, for example, you only had to give up 55p to buy a dollar, then that 75 pound US textbook would be cheaper priced in sterling.